What's up, YouTube? Franchise Sports TV back again with another video. I almost said Franchise History TV, but Franchise Sports TV back again. Uh, got a good one. Now. I promise that I'll make this video, and now here it is. But before we begin, like, share, subscribe, and also comment down below. So I think it was either today. I think it was today, earlier today. Now, uh, some of us might know, some of us might not know. But the NBA came out with new trophies. Name them all, actually. So every trophy you can think of, every award you can win, six man, most improved defensive player, yada, 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 all have names for them. So the MVP trophy caused some, some, up, some uproar today, but I'm happy. So uh, I'm going to go through all the trophies. So the MVP trophy now, the regular season MVP trophy, is now... Named after Michael Jordan. So that tells you that the NBA thinks that Michael Jordan is the GOAT. Not LeBron James. Hey, name, name it after Kareem. Dang. Now you think about it. They didn't name it after Kareem. But it's not LeBron James. I think some idiot on Twitter said LeBron James should be on all of them. Which doesn't make sense at all. But anyways. It tells you how much the LeQuire is delusional. But uh, Nick Wright had a hissy fit about it. I think probably Shannon Sharp had another hissy fit about it. If I was him, I wouldn't even be on Undisputed Tape. But anyways, it is what it is. Got to make the money. I'm sure those two and all the LaCroix object to that. But um, basically what they said on the Twitter, I think it was Chicago's Twitter, Bulls Twitter, that... Um, <laughs> Of course they think it, but when Michael Jordan trophy is bearing the name of the greatest player of all time, which is true. I don't understand. I just don't understand the reasons behind uh, people saying LeBron being the goat. Let me get this out here straight. Let me get this out here straight. My favorite player of all time is not Michael Jordan, though. It's Ray Allen. Being growing up in Milwaukee, but Jordan is in my top ten. Of all player favorite players of all time, so that there's that. But I'm gonna say again, this is what disqualifies LeBron out of the goat discussion. You cannot go three for eleven in a finals game. You cannot choke in a finals game multiple times. Maybe just that one time. You cannot choke. You cannot do it. I cannot put you there in the GOAT conversation if you do it. Now, LeBron James, he's an amazing player. No doubt. We ain't going to deny this. I'm not going to sit here and say he sucks. I ain't going to say that. But he's no GOAT. Kobe is closer in that discussion more than anything. I had a discussion about that today. Just because Kobe put 56 on Jordan, an older Jordan's head, does not make him better than Jordan. When the man tried to be, during his total career, tried to be closest to Jordan. Yes, Kobe is closest to Jordan. He ain't the GOAT. Sorry. But he's closer to being in the GOAT conversation than LeBron is. So there's that. There's that trophy. Um, next is the Defensive Player of the Year, Hakeem Elijah Trophy. I know some people have some objections to that. I know Ticket TV said they should have made it after Ben Simmons. Ben Simmons. <laughs> ben Wallace, I mean. Ben Simmons. Damn. Now we know where all Ben Simmons' powers went to. It went to a uh, rapper who calls herself a stallion. But anyways, um, you heard about that news. But, yeah, the Defensive Player of the Year is named after Hakeem Olajuwon. Many, many people would have said Dikembe Mutombo was a better defender or Ben Wallace, which I actually might make a video on Ben Wallace later on. I actually might think about, ah, thinking about coming up with a new series. Rookie of the Year is Wilt Chamberlain. Sixth Man of the Year is John Havacek. Uh, some people have some objections to that, I guess. Might be far fetched. Lou Williams? He won like Lou Williams? He won like three of those motherfuckers. Four of them. Most improved, George Mikan. And clutch player of the year, Jerry West, which some people had some objections to. Um, they don't know why they continue to keep putting Jerry West and stuff. But uh, 
like I said, I understand why Jordan is. It makes sense. Some people could have said Bill Russell for the MVP. Some people could have said Kareem for the NBA's MVP. Uh, for Olajuwon, reason why they pick Olajuwon, he's one of the three players in league history, Jordan, Giannis, to win the MVP and Defensive Player of the Year in the same season. That doesn't make sense because, oh, it makes sense. I'm thinking Finals MVP, number bad. Uh, perhaps the greatest defensive player, uh, defensive center ever graced the hardware, which some people would have said Dikembe. Chamberlain was the first player in the NBA history to win the Rookie of the Year, so that's why he got it. He got it in 1959. Uh, and, and NBA regular season MVP. The only other person that got it was Wes Unseld. Halbachek was the greatest sixth man in the sport. That's what uh, they're generalizing. Not generalizing, but the reason why they picked these players for that award. Um, actually, that award didn't exist until 1982. 83 season. So that's why they picked him. Uh, clutch player of the year. The reason why they picked that. I guess Jerry was considered to be clutch. So. Um, they have other. I forgot they also have other. Um, award names for players too. Because we all know they got the. Finals MVP named after Bill Russell. They also got the All-Star MVP at the name Kobe, of course. They also, what I didn't realize, I didn't even realize this, they have the Eastern and Western Conference trophies named after Bob Cousy and Oscar Robertson, as well as naming the uh, it was the Eastern Conference Finals MVP, Western Conference Finals MVP after Larry Bird and um, Magic. So I guess they're trying to Bring a little fling, a little zing to the awards, but it is what it is. But the only one I truly agree with is the Michael Jordan one and Will Chamberlain, first rookie of the year. But those defensive players in the clutch can be disputed. But I know, I know some of the, the, the LaCroix are not happy with that. I just don't understand the guy on Twitter. Some guy on Twitter said that LeBron needs to be named after it all that. Uh, LeBron never came off the bench. LeBron did win Rookie of the Year. LeBron has been an MVP. Uh, LeBron has never got a Defensive Player of the Year. In recent years, he has played a lack of defense. Um, what's the other one? Clutch Player of the Year? <laughs> Clutch Player of the Year. He had a couple of good games in 2018. I will deny that, but he was never known as Clutch, so it makes sense. That's easily de de debunked, but... That's all I had to say about the matter. Tell me what you guys think.